people have periodically tried to build facilities that they think would last forever or last for a thousand years or something, but I don't know of anything that's been built other than the seat vault for that kind of long time framework. The seed vault is an insurance policy for world agriculture and we simply have a facility that freezes seeds and provides a backup safety duplicate of all the different seed samples of all the different varieties of agricultural crops. The United States, Korean, um, South Korean, Ukraine, Israel, Kenya, Germany, um, what do we have over here? We are now seeing, and will see in the next 50 years, climates that agriculture and the crops have never seen before since the dawn of agriculture in the last 15,000 years. Obviously, our crops are not adapted to conditions they have never experienced before. And since crops are domesticated, basically their evolution, their development is in our hands. We're about 130 meters inside the mountain from the front door. And at the end of this long tunnel, there are three vault rooms. One of them has seed in it, so we've got hundreds of millions of seeds in that room. And two are ready for seed at some point in the future. One of the most interesting ones is right here. Uh, this is ICARDA, which is the International Center in Aleppo, Syria. They have a safety duplicate of their collection here in Svalbard, which is a great thing since the city and the area is in a state of war right now. I think doomsday happens every day. It happens in small bits and pieces. It happens quietly. So here's a very quiet solution. I'm rather comfortable thinking about what we're doing today and how it prepares agriculture um, 500 years from now or a thousand years from now. That's sort of the time frame I tend to think in. And I realize that separates me from almost everybody else. But every time we put a sample in the seed vault, I sort of breathe a big sigh of relief, thinking, oh, you know, great. This sample, this crop variety is, is safe. It's basically safe forever as far as, you know, we have any guarantees in this world.